Hey guys, what is up? Ando here today bringing you guys another cartoon creepypasta. In this cartoon creepypasta, we are reading Rugrats Lost Episode, Chucky's Mom. Um, if you guys want to read the story for yourself, the link will be down in the description below, so be sure to go check it out. Um, also, drop a like on this video and hit that subscribe button if you think you guys are going to enjoy. So with that said, let's just go ahead and get right into the story. Remember Rugrats? That show on Nickelodeon? What you probably don't know is that the creator of the show, Gaber Kasupo, originally planned a late night version of Rugrats called Rugrascals to be played at night with more adult humor. Because every major channel thought the pilot was too disturbing, they refused to air the show. And as a result, no one has really heard about it. However, one station in Wellington, New Zealand mistakenly played it in the morning thinking it was a regular Rugrats episode. The pilot and only episode of the show that was seen was called Chucky's Mom. The intro played like normal. But at the end when Tommy shoots the milk at the screen the sound effect is much louder. And the milk simply stays there for about 10 seconds. Then the name of the episode appears. The episode played out like normal, with the babies playing in the playpen. They are all talking about their moms, when Chucky has a flashback. It had Chucky in a hospital standing next to his mother in bed, who was dying from an unknown illness. She was singing, You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. To Chucky in a very weak voice, as if she was about to die, but when she sang the second verse, the song started playing in reverse. A shot of Chucky appeared in front of a live action footage of a chicken's head being chopped off, said to represent death by fans. Chucky turns around and screams, and when he looks back at his mother, her face has a live action man's mouth pasted on it saying don't worry Chucky it's time for me to move on and a man's voice a flurry of random live action clips were shown said to represent death like a cow walking into a box with slaughterhouse crudely drawn on the side footage of the LA riot other cartoons and actual footage of a man suffering from AIDS being killed. You can hear Chucky screaming the entire time. A shot of Chucky's mom appears again, this time with a chicken's beak crudely pasted onto her face saying, don't you remember where it all started? The episode then cuts the live action footage of childish sonograms. After about one minute of the sonograms, you hear Chucky's mom say, Aren't you a lucky ducky, Chucky? A Harley Quinn fetus appears at the time. You see Chucky come out of the flashback, having a seizure. Tommy, Phil, and Lil are crying, and an ambulance worker calms him down, saying, Chucky, Chucky, can you hear me? In a stern voice. Eventually, after coughing up blood and vomiting, Chucky comes to his senses. We then see a point of view shot of Chucky seeing Tommy, Phil, Lil, and the ambulance worker as having live action chicken beaks on their faces, clucking away. A photo of a kid that looks just like Chucky screaming appears and the camera zooms into it. After this, the regular credits played, followed by 15 minutes of static as the station had nothing else to play. Surprisingly, although the episode was watched by many children, only one adult who was watching has spoken about it until now. I was inspired to find out that children's suicide went higher in New Zealand. Alright guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you guys have, be sure to drop a like. Be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Follow me on all my social media. All the links are down in the description as well with the story. Uh, 
And yeah, leave a comment in the comment section down below. Tell me your thoughts on this story. I thought it was really good. So I want to know your guys' thoughts and also tell me what other stories you guys would like to see. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.